Welcome back to Make Way for Cat. We are back in Moon Glow Bay. It's been a few days since I've played, so I have to look at the quest log and see where we're at. Free fish using the strong rod. Okay. Turn this one back. Town bulletin. Okay, let's check the town bulletin and then we'll go out and do our, our fishing with the strong rod. Request from Claire. I don't have any of this stuff. I'll pick up one in case I catch it. Okay, so it seems like we need to be out here. I guess I'm still supposed to go talk to him at the library. Okay, so I don't need to be on my boat. Oh, hey. Huh. I think I have fish taco. Wait. <laughs> no. Wrong button. Wrong button. Hey. Hey. Hmm. Does the same thing every time. <laughs> Uh, yeah, we're fishing on the pier. Oh, what's this? A crab pot? When did I get a crab pot? I don't remember getting this at all. So, strong lure. Or strong rod. Go spinner. Bait. Fish. Yeah, it's definitely harder to pull in. But it does look like it doesn't have as Like, it needs to go further to get away. Okay, I've got got this one before. Which is good. Any fish. Any fish for cooking. I can't really expect to get new ones out here because it's based on bait, not rod. Come here. I honestly feel like these are harder to catch with this rod. Okay. What is happening? Objective complete. Oh, in the open chill. Okay. I thought I had to be on the boat. Go with that. Open chill is this way. 
No, I don't know what the point of collecting trash in the water is. I say that I'm going to keep the trash, and it doesn't show up in my inventory. Let's zoom out a bit more. Be nice if the trash had like a purpose or something you could recycle it into shells or something skates need open chill there it is let's hope for some new stuff here Inspector Fish! Hey, he was on the, uh, bulletin board. Might have to pick that one up. If I get a couple more of them. This one's going to the museum. Yeah. Oh, it's got, like, a magnifying glass on its tail. Oh, no, you don't. No, you don't. Come here. Chloe. Uh, since we're in a new area, I'm gonna fish for a little bit out here. Let's change. I'm gonna go back to the balance rod because I like it better. We'll do plug. We won't do any bait. Go this side. I've had him before. Ooh, ploy fish. Dave. Getting a good mix of fish I can cook and fish to donate. Another bluey. All right, I think this will be it. Let's go. I wish you would keep your settings. Like, every time I, I try to pan out all the way. Oh, oh, what's happening? Going this way. Anchor up. 
Okay, so the museum is closed right now. Let me grab the other bulletin board, though. If they're looking for one inspector fish, I'll take it. Three. I don't have three. Let's see if we can cook with anything. Fisher chips, purple tail. This is always usually good. New recipe! Yay! Let's see what we got. Lobster. This is the low flying fish. Ah, we can catch a lot of those around here. I don't have any crab yet. Make some more fish tacos. Here you and the pollock. They're actually um. Pretty easy to make, because of the chop and the fry. It's the washing and the boiling that I really hate. Just so time consuming. Boom. Let's see if we can cook a few more. Spectre fish I want to Put a dace. When did I catch that? What is happening? I don't remember any of these. I don't remember catching the hooded dace. I don't remember getting the crab pot. Go to bed. Uh. So I think I have a quest to hand over. Yeah. I don't wanna. Museum's gonna be a bit... Harris usually runs through here somewhere early in the morning. Here. Alright, let's put some in here. Ooh, nice. Scent on that guy. Three in here. Let's see if the bulletin board has anything new. Speak to Jake. Sounds easy enough. I don't know who Jake is, but we'll uh we'll give it a go. Talk to her. Go. Oh, I've already donated the hooded days. What? Yeah. Alright, great. Then we will give this one to Abby. Enough, and then we'll find out where Jake is. That's not Abby.
Abby's usually in her boat shop here during the day. Uh. Item. <laughs> Here are the shells. Okay. <laughs> That's one down. Now, let's check. Okay, so there's something over here, and then we need to pay a visit to the library. Oh, that's right. I need to talk to these guys, too. There you are. Cat, I'd like to introduce you to Felix Wilson. Yes, THE Felix Wilson. Angler extraordinaire. It must be very exciting to meet me. Sophie's already explained the regular and strong rods, and they're fine. For novices. Hey, I'm right here, pal. For something that requires a touch more skill, you want the poise rod. The poise rod makes your strikes very effective, but trickier to perform. But with practice, it'll provide an overall swifter and more satisfying piscatorial experience. The poise rod also reduces the initial line tension when reeling aggressive species. Here, take mine. A gift from one professional, recognizing the other. Ah, wow, thanks. That's extremely generous of... And now a challenge! Catch three fish using the poise rod at Lonely Rock. I shall await your return here, where I stand. Actually, we still need to find William. He's wandered off. Ah, then I shall await your return somewhere else. Farewell, Catfisher. Okay. So that must be... Showing me where I'm supposed to go. out here. Okay, so that's Lonely Rock. Oh, this must be Jake then. Kind of a pain that it doesn't show me what objective it is. I was literally just over there. Maybe he's moving around. Maybe we'll hit the library on the way? I think we'll hit the library on the way. Uh, right here. No? Okay, so it's not ready to give me the next one I'm supposed to save? What are you over here? Lily. <laughs> Jake, here we go. Greetings, fellow angler. Know ye the mighty devourer? <laughs> that friend will gobble up your whole wardrobe. <sighs> Eats planks of mahogany? No, I mean your outfit. Your clothes. Small articles, anyway. What I'm saying is, it once ate a sock, I reckon. Here we go. Handy way to earn some extra shells if we're passing by. We promised the mayor we'd invest in the cozy cavern we did. Okay, so now we can probably talk to the mayor. No. We already invested in the cozy cavern. Oh, this must be William. It is. I can't talk to them until I get the other. That's right, it's not open until like 3 o'clock in the afternoon. Yep. Okay. Boys Rod Challenge. It just says library. It doesn't give me any tasks. Here's one. First have to look out for renovation signs across town. I haven't seen a single one. Alright, let's go do the Boys Rod Challenge. Uh... 
I missed that one. Let's make some bait first. Since it's getting late anyway, we'll make some bait and go to bed. And we'll head out bright and, bright and early. Why is it showing release on my screen? Almost a thousand shells. Great. Oh, hey! There you are! Okay, this is different. I always want to create something more permanent than food. Doesn't mean it's not important if it doesn't last forever. The impermanence of a good meal, that makes it special. Thanks for the fish tacos. Same time tomorrow. Maybe. Alright. So we're going to use the boys rod. I'm going to use the jig one this time. I didn't even make the bait. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. As you're crossing... Oh, push the box. Only rock. Great. Release is still on my screen. Maybe it'll go away when I catch another fish. This one doesn't feel any different than the balanced rod. Okay, nothing new here. I'm gonna try one more time. At least the release button went away. Feels good. A little stormy by a long walk. I wish I could see ahead of the boat. Right, so I could see that that was coming. Alright, so at least I know where to meet them this time. Okay, not quite the shortcut I was hoping for. I guess it was. Ah, our conquering hero returns. Cat, may I introduce William Bennett? I understand these are two 
pretenders have these two pretenders have already covered the basics. Pff, the poise rod is clearly the best. What? Strong beats poise any day. For the true angling professional, you want the agile rod. The agile rod has the shortest line, so fish won't need much room to escape. However, it has the swiftest reel by far, and reduces the initial line tension when reeling fast species. With practice, it can be extremely efficient. Here, take mine. As thanks on behalf of the Moonglow Angling Collective. And now a challenge? And now a challenge! Three fish, agile rod, icy wall. The winds of change bring stormy seas. You can already taste the ozone in the air. It's the precursor to something huge. Soon the skies will darken, the sea will tremble, and a furious furious wrath will wash across the bay. Beware. Beware! The storm fish awakes! <laughs> what? Challenge accepted. <laughs> Alright. Uh, yeah. I just want to finish these angling challenges. Let's go. Boys, agile rod, do spinner again, and no bait. Icy wall is this way, I'm pretty certain. Okay. Can't zoom out anymore. Pretty certain the icy wall was like right here somewhere. No. Broken glacier. Uh oh oh what? It's way out there. There's no getting around that way. We're gonna have to go through Waking Storm and up. What is this? Go a little bit to the east first until we hit the waking storm. Broken glacier. Okay, we're going the right way. Just a little more north than I thought we'd be. Head north? Yeah, waking storm. Icy wall. Alright. Let's do it. Uh, there we go. Let's see how this goes. That was quick. Bluefish. Or bluefish. I think that is task done.
think I've mastered these rods now. Para said the sea market would be open when I return. Okay, so that's where I go next. Uh, no. No. Get. See if we can get back. Waking storm. All right, we're going to go south until we hit the waking storm. South? Feels like this boat goes so slow. This is the way I went before. Right. If I follow these markers on the map now, I should be good to go. Yeah, as you're crossing, so we're good. I recognize those. See the lighthouse. Uh, if you try to turn at a certain angle, your camera's a certain way, the controls end up being backwards. That's why that there was that weird little I almost hit the wall there. Right, I doubt he's open this late, but we could check we could check. we go. <laughs> Cat, welcome to the sea market. We're finally back in business. <gasps> you guys work fast. Ah. Heh, let me give you the tour. First, the fishmonger. Should you ever need fresh ingredients in a pish, pinch? Oh. Next, there's the bait exchange. Excellent. That's what we need. It's the bigger bait. Finally, there's our resident culinary guru, Kevin Road, for recipes and cooking supplies. Yikes, speaking of cutting things fine, I should get ready for my meeting at Town Hall. Hey, you should come along. With these ominous skies, our community needs to stick together. Sure, I'll meet you there, right after a quick browse. Alright, that's where I'm going to end this episode. In the next one, we'll take a look and we'll uh, meet at Town Hall. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.